Supporters of Governor Ron DeSantis are getting more and more nervous about his run for the presidency. The latest fear, a confidential memo first obtained by NBC News, which shows donors recent poll numbers. Week News reporter Claire Galt details the memo as our Florida governor looks to remain calm. The new and improved Ron DeSantis playbook. The Florida governor sent this memo to donors. Someone leaked it to NBCNews.com. The message? The best is yet to come. This is just DeSantis' team making sure that their donors and that their um, big supporters know that they have a game plan that will get them through to a victory at the convention. Uh, and so this is their way of making sure they can get them locked down. Page one, fundraising, state of the race. Ron DeSantis is a powerhouse, pulling in record high donations. No one is a threat. Not Donald Trump, not Senator Tim Scott. Page two, the message, his biography. Stop woke culture, revive the economy, rethink China. Page three, the policy, the fight, the formula. Focus on early voting states. Talk to the media, go to debates, hold town halls. What this is really about is making sure resources are in place so that when it comes time uh, to win and to compete in those early battleground states, uh, that they have those lined up. Andrew Sund, chairman of the Conservative Leadership Conference, doesn't look at the memo as a sign DeSantis is worried. He believes DeSantis is already in good standing despite his stagnant poll numbers. This memo, if he executes, can only help. I think uh, it's definitely important for him to get on the ground and start making those connections and to make sure that message gets out there. Talking to the media gives him more exposure. Visiting the early voting states as much as possible, bonus points. And dominating a debate when the former president is a no-show, gold star. First want a candidate who is capable and is willing to fight for them. And I think any candidate who's not willing to show up on a debate stage and talk about the ideas, I think that's a turnoff to the voters. And DeSantis makes it clear in the memo he plans to show up everywhere. Claire Gall, Link News. Now, the first Republican debate is August 23rd in Milwaukee. Governor DeSantis will be there. Former President Trump has signaled he doesn't need to take part, and he says he probably won't.